Today, Rog and myself have 2,000 cannonballs each. We can only use them in multi-areas and can use any gear alongside. We can also complete any clues we get, then we fight. Yikes! You think my knees are crusty? Right. End it. Thank you, boy. End them all. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Bs and Gs of super satisfied. Hello, Bs and Gs. So welcome back to another PvP challenge. As you can see, I'm geared up to go into the wilderness. Now, my plan here is to go into the Wildy Slayer Cave and kill Hellhounds here. Uh, the reason for that is we'll get, you know, blighted sacks, blighted food, blighted pots. But on top of that, they drop uh, hard clues so commonly that it just makes sense to go kill them. Uh, so yeah, we are going to go for the Hellhounds here um, and see what we can grab. Now, we can wear anything we want. Um, obviously, I'm going to the Wildy, so I'm going in with a slightly lower budget than I normally would or for the max DPS. 2,000 cannonballs. I'll probably do like 500 at a time. Mainly looking for hard clues here. That's the whole point in my plan. So let's go ahead and see how we do. A massive thank you to GMG Glasses for sponsoring today's video. One thing we all do for hours every single day is look at screens. And this can be really detrimental to your eyes, your sleep, and your concentration. And all of these issues can be attributed to blue light that emits from your screen. Thankfully, the GMG glasses have a blue light filter in them, meaning all those negative effects can be reduced or completely cut out while using them. Since using them for the first time around two years ago, I've felt that whenever my sleep is starting to get pretty bad, wearing these during the week or very late at night when I'm about to go to bed and I'm still doing some late night editing or something like that, these really help with my sleep. They are hugely beneficial to anyone who sits behind a computer for hours on end. Like I do, I feel that it cuts my eye strain massively while using these. So if you want to get yourself 40% off, yes, 40% off in the next 48 hours, that's the only time you'll be able to grab them for that price. Uh, use the link in the description and you'll get that 40% off. Hey guys and welcome. In this challenge we have 2,000 cannonballs, but we can only use them in multi-zone areas. That is a really big fact there because that cuts out a lot of areas where you still would typically use a cannon. And there's also a lot of places where you can't even drop a cannon. Things like the Iorth dungeon, for example, single combat, smoke dungeon, single combat, Forthos dungeon, can't lay a cannon down. And that's just to name a few. I spent like two hours trying to theory craft this and I ended up just going with a very simple plan that I think could actually be very beneficial. The first thing we're gonna do is head to the Wildy. We're gonna kill hellhounds to try to get as many clue scrolls as possible because we can do clues that we get during this challenge. And of course with clues, you can get rune items, you can get black dehyde since magic should be fairly easy at least to get the cast. So I don't know too much about armor and weapons. It's not that easy because I did look into it unless I'm missing something. But in case magic is involved and we get dehyde, rune, maybe even an MSB, I think we'll be sitting really pretty. So I'm going to try to go for clues. Let's do it. Okay, here we go. Let's set up the cannon. And as I said, just going with 500 cannibals to kick off here. I'll probably do 500 cannibal batches. And uh, yeah, let's see what happens. Boom. First drop, we get entangle sacks. Ooh, we got some Vengeance Sacks. Very nice. There's a Blighted Anglerfish. Huge for the fight. And there's a Karamb one. Two more Anglerfish. A small problem I'm having. And, you know, it's not a massive problem. I won't, I won't lie. But there is like a rat spawn here. I don't know if it's one or two. But the cannon keeps grabbing those rats. So I don't know if I should go over to this side a little bit. Because I am wasting cannonballs on fucking rats. Which is not ideal. Ooh, there's a Blighted Super Restore. Really nice. All right, that is the first load of 500. Just got 37 left in the cannon. So as soon as that runs out, I will just uh, pick it up and dip. So I will preemptively just drop a couple things. Uh, we are going off the loot tracker. I've killed 73. No way. Uh, 73 right now. I will show you the full loot from the first 500. The lowdown, though, I've, I'm have i completely sorted on food, as you can see. I'm just <laughs> It's just everywhere at the moment. Uh, but there's, a, there's another cool couple of things there as well. Um, which I will show you once we get out of here. Um, the only issue I would say is I haven't seen a clue scroll at all. It's meant to be 1 in 30 with the hard achievement diaries done. And I have the hard achievement or the combat diaries. And I have that done. So I should have seen two hard clues by now. I'm pretty sure I checked before. Like, I'm almost certain I checked before I started the, uh, the recording that I don't have a hard clue in the bank. But I am going to check when we get back. But yeah, I'm almost certain that we're uh, we're good here. 
Um, we're, we're, we're smashing it, though. You know, off 500 cannibals, getting 76 hellhounds. Yeah, we might not have... Uh, we might not have grabbed... Oh, we want some ancient ice axe for sure. Um, we might not have grabbed a hard clue yet, but this does mean we should be able to, on average, get a good few by the end of the 2,000 cannibals. All right. We're not going to get another kill here, I don't think. No. Let's pick up the cannon and let's get out of here. Boom. Uh, let me show you the loot. So, yeah, 79 hellhounds killed there. Uh, 21 anglerfish, 9 manta rays. So, we, our food's already sorted. We have 28, 22 heals um, already sorted. 29 ancient ice sacks, which is pretty sick. Um, and we have 32 vengeances. So, 32 vengeances is easily enough for a fight if I do decide to go down the Lunar's route. Um, but, I think I do want to just try and pump this up to maybe 100 or so then we can really start to think about going for ice barrage um but yeah just no hard clues let's do a quick live reaction to whether or not i have hard clues in my bank because uh, that would be really awkward if i do but I i'm sure i don't no i don't no hard clues guys so yeah i just got mad unlucky i guess so the last time we did a challenge like this a lot of people told us to use things like venom and to use things like the ring of suffering or recoils to actually get as much damage as you can possibly get and those things aren't technically off limits but we can't abuse them meaning we can't just you know venom a hellhound and let our cannon run out and be like oh well in that case i'll let the venom do the rest of the work no we can't do that we could use it we just can't abuse it and I know that if you kill Hellhounds with the Ring of uh, Ring of Wealth Eye, it's actually 1 in 32 instead of 1 in 64. Blink and I just agreed for the reasons I just stated since people mentioned them that we have to stick with the Ring of Suffering. So that is why I have it on. I, I do know it technically isn't the best, but it is part of the rules of this challenge. I'm in the wildy, so I won't be using the meta. But, you know, we got the important pieces. And let's get on prayer and stuff and pot. There we go. There we go. I always make the mistake of bringing way too much food, so I did just drop all my sharks. We did get our first superstore. I think one's fine for the fight. And we also already have 13 vengeance sacks, because I'm sure I'll want to bring that to the fight as well, because I don't plan on going barrage. I mean, if I got really lucky with barrage casts, I wouldn't mind changing my plan to barrage. But um, yeah, considering I already use like 150 cannonballs and don't have one barrage pack yet, you know, that's probably, probably not going to happen. All right, when my cannon runs out of ammo, we are going to bank because I'm an idiot and, I, you know, I forgot my looting bag and I'd rather be looting this stuff than not. But as you can see, second superstore, there's so much food. Like, food isn't going to be an issue at all to get. We got all this food with only, like, 200 and, what is that, like, maybe 40 cannonballs-ish. So, funny story. When I went to bank, I actually forgot to grab a looting bag. You know, the entire reason I went to bank uh is what it is this isn't really a time challenge so i'm not like rushing through this so it's fine just wanted to point out that i just got my 65th kill so that is one kill over the drop rate and i haven't even used 500 cannonballs so if everything works out i would hopefully like to get at least four clue scrolls ideally maybe like three i can get an msb i want an msb and then I can go for arrows and maybe some black dehyde. I'm being kind of ambitious with this idea, but I'm thinking even if it doesn't work out, I can still get room pieces or just other items that I could bring into the fight rather than relying on RNG from, you know, monsters. I'm relying, I guess, I guess I still am relying on RNG from monsters. I'm literally dry right now. I don't know. That's how my brain works. I, I think it's a cool idea. I'm a little nervous. I'm not going to get any clue scrolls, but I'd have to go insanely dry for that to happen. Thought that was one right there. Damn it. I've decided the fact that that was under 30 wildy. I'm actually going to take all the rest of the cannonballs I have just because it's so easy to get out with the one click telly here, um, which I wasn't actually sure whether or not I would be able to one to click telly out before I got here. I've actually never killed hellhounds here before. Um, so yeah, I'm going to stick with that. And uh, this time we've got all the cannonballs with us. But I'm hoping we telly out before that because we get a hard clue because that is what my whole plan is based on. It's just nailing like five or six hard clues you know getting an msb because the reason i'm thinking it is it's so easy to get ice barrage in this challenge like so easy you just do this and you get a load of like ancient ice sacks or whatever you want to do you can kill anything in the worldy um so my thought process is if we can get an msb some dehyde oh my god will we be looking good for the fight you know so uh yeah if we can get an msb early so i can then focus on getting some arrows together because obviously i don't want to start getting arrows together right now before i'm sure whether or not i'm able to uh go down that route you know um so we'll see wow just got a magic short bow scroll 
So if my plan comes together, we could actually have a MSB imbued by the end of this. If everything goes completely to plan. I've now killed a hundred hellhounds and I don't have a hard clue to my name. So, you know, it's <laughs> madness that I got this before that, but okay. Um, what is that? Yeah, that's one in 326. It's literally 10 times rarer than a, than a clue scroll. So, uh, yeah, there we go. What the fuck is going on? I've just got two Trover parchments. Like, what? I can't get a hard clue, but I'm getting, like, loot left, right, and center. It's mad. It's actually mad. I've killed 130. That's one in 1.3k. I'm so confused. Hey, we finally got one. Unreal stuff. Let's drop this. Pick this bad boy up. Get out of here. Um, <laughs> I, I don't know why that's taken so long. 135 kills. Um, incredible. But there we go. Let's see. What are we doing? Awesome. Oh, my God. There it is. Oh. That's such a slap to the dick. That's wrong. That's wrong. Not only does it look like a clue scroll, but it would obviously help me get clue scrolls. Fuck you, what's the rarity of this thing? Fuck you. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Hellhound. One in 326. I just want a clue scroll. It is one in 64, and I've killed 119 of you fuckers. Yeah, safe to assume this game is now gaslighting me. I already checked, but I have to double check that I don't have a hard clue in the bank. Hard. There is no hard clue. Clue scroll, just in case I spelt like hard wrong or something. Beginner, elite, medium. The, and this isn't a fucking clue scroll either, even though it looks like one. Where are my clue scrolls? This is literally stupid. I've killed 168. I'm convinced it's not even on the drop table. I'm here thinking like, oh, maybe they took it off the wieldy drop table. Nope, it's there. One in 64. And it loves reminding me one in 32 if I had the ring on. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Wiki. Thank you for the scroll drop too, Jagex. So apparently if you have the hard combat achievement diary tier reward done, it actually changes from a one in 64 to a one in 60. It should say it here somewhere. The chance of all hard clue scrolls from sources, excluding implings, is increased by 5%. Am I doing something wrong? Like it's even more common than we thought. Again, it tricked me. Again, 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 I see the shape on the ground it's the wrong thing i'm making good money i've made 775k so far from killing these fuckers 775k i've also if you guys haven't noticed i've kind of i'm standing a bit askew from the cannon so it actually uses a bit less still burning through them really fast well would you look who decided to show up i don't even know where the fuck there he is there he fucking is oh my god God, it exists. I'm not going insane. 219 kills. Jagex, you owe me a magic short bow. That's all I want. We're even. You give me a magic short bow and we are even. You don't even have to give me black dehyde. Just give me a magic short bow and we're even. I'll call it even. All right, guys, we got a casket here. I mean, obviously we want the magic short bow. Um, and any sort of black dehyde or god dehyde is what I'm really looking for here. So, let's see what we get. Oh no! Oh no! At least we got black dehyde body, but no! Oh! oh I'm almost, I'm almost tempted. You can't use the scroll on that, can you? You can't make a magic longbow eye. Magic longbow. No, you, you can't. You can't. I'm poor. <sighs> I'm almost tempted. I am like, cause I have like over a thousand cannonballs ah, to use and I could just like get a load of arrows. It's just so bad. It's a five tick range weapon. Ah, no, it's not good enough. That would have been perfect if we just got the uh, the magic short bow with that, but okay. All right, we are gonna go for at least another clue scroll. I'm gonna go back to the Hellhounds and see if we can, if we can grab another one, see if we can test our luck. 
like literally instantly. What have I done? 140, 140 kills now and we get another one. <laughs> I can't remember what it was. 134 or something I got the last clue scroll at. So the RNG is evening out. So that's what we like to hear. Play complication. Yeah, this whole fucking experience has been way too complicated. Jeez. All right. Okay. Jagex. Remember a little deal that we had? <clears throat> Let's see. Mm. <laughs> you guys are probably thinking it's pretty silly to go back. Well, uh, I'm a pretty silly guy. No way I go that dry twice. I mean, if I did, I would literally run out of cannonballs, so I can't. Either, either we get what we want or we die trying. Okay, that's cool and all. I haven't been there that long to get another clue scroll. But why am I getting these rare drops that look just like clue scrolls that aren't clue scrolls? It's, I just want clue scrolls. I have to tell you. I have to tell you. I have to tell you. I'm out of darts, which is actually the real reason why I'm telling. But 405 cannonballs killed the drop rate again. Just kind of hoping I get another at this point. Not even for an MSP at this point, because I wouldn't have enough to then get arrows. But just any rune equipment would have been amazing in the fight. Or a weapon that I still need. Now, I've gotten 92 barrage casts. So I'm going to fall back on plan B. And that's try to get magic gear as as much as possible it's not going to be too straightforward it's not going to be too easy but it's sort of possible i just ran all around gilinor checking all different places to see if it's single to get things like magic gear like zamorak robes or any type of staff to be honest at least any type of elemental staff because it's at least plus 10 not like a plus six attack bonus in magic my shield gives negative six so that wouldn't really work Every single place I tried is either single combat or you can't lay down a cannon. I even tried to do the ZMI to see if I get like a rune simi if I would rather go melee because again the staff plan wasn't really working. I think genuinely my best bet is to just keep trying for clue scrolls and then if I don't get anything just YOLO mage with no gear on at all. Like bring nothing to the fight just a full inventory of food pots and runes. There is no easy way for me to get a staff. And with only 405, there's no simple way I can get a weapon. But I, I, if I go drop rate, which I know is a big if, but if I go drop rate, I could still get a melee weapon from a hard clue scroll. And if I don't, I just go magic. But I could also get something else like dehide, which would be great to bring to a fight. All right, guys, another hard clue. Again, looking for that magic short bow. Ooh, man, another black dehyde body. Really didn't want that. Rune longsword. Okay, all right. Mm, not great. Right, guys, getting very close to the point where I am going to have to just ditch this idea. I've got 690 cannonballs left. I guess with the fort we've got there, a little bit more. But this is uh, this is not good. We've had two hard clues in 206 Hellhounds, which is just crazy bad luck. Um, I'm going to try and go for one more. I'm going to try and see if we can pull one more Hellhound. Um, or hard close, sorry. Um, and if we can't before 500 cannonballs, then I'm going to have to go somewhere. And I think I'm going to have to go for the Magic Longbow. I genuinely do, which is so sad. But I think I'm going to have to, uh, just because we've got the Black Dehyde body. And we've got nothing on our legs. Oh, it's been a disaster. It's been a disaster, B's and G's. I am probably going to go Vengeance as well. I can't see myself going for the uh, the Ice Barrage, to be completely honest. Um, I think it's just, you know, going to be too hard to pull off. But then again, I do have 87 of them. If I could just get myself a Water Star from somewhere, maybe I'd do that. I don't know. I'm not in the greatest of places right now. I'll see you at 500 Cannibals and we'll see where we're at. Honestly, I am... No, it's bad. This is bad. Oh, my God. Okay. Incredible. Clue scroll. Let's get out. Let's get out. Get out of here. Pick up. Don't waste the cannibals. And if we go down to the bottom here, I think we can actually just telly out of the home teleport. Um, yep, we can. Sick. Okay. All right. That makes me feel a bit better. Let's see if we can pull this magic short bow. Here we go. Casket number three of the video. We know what we want to get. Come on. No, oh, but at least I got that i guess at least i got that and that rune plate legs really huge i'm i i think i might have to go down the rune plate legs black um dehyde body into an msb or longbow a longbow not even an msb a magic longbow 
<laughs> Part of me just wants to take it to the fight as well, guys. Like, but I genuinely think it might be our best setup. If he goes magic, like, obviously we won't have all of this stuff on. But like, if he goes magic, we got forty-one plus magic defense bonus, and the longbow will cut through him in like just nothing like a lot of the time when kins turns up to a pvp fight with magic he just has a staff that's it and it will out dps him doing that obviously we can take the rune plate legs off i, th I think i think i need to find somewhere that's going to drop me a load of arrows whether it's rune or addy i don't know we'll have to work that out but i, I think i have to guys because i can't i can't rely on these hellhounds because they could take the rest of the cannonballs and i could just end up with nothing i'd have to fight with like this i mean i guess i could fight like that but that's not ideal, is it? Not ideal at all. And there's no way I could do this, because if he goes magic, I'm in so much trouble. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, pick up the cannon! Don't waste any more cannonballs! Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up! We're out of here. We're out of here. Oh my god, I didn't think it was going to happen. I did not think we were going to get another one. 88 cannonballs left. Oh my god, I mean, that's awful. If this clue is bad, then we're done, Ski. Uh, so, good luck us. All right, guys, we got the casket. We got the casket. This could be the make or break. Let's see what we get. Oh my God. OMG. We got two of them. I only have 88 cannonballs left. We gotta make that count. We gotta make 88 cannonballs count. Oh! All right, I've worked out my plan. We are going to go back to Ferox now. We're actually going to go back to the Worldy Slayer Cave, but we're going to kill Ankus because they drop rune arrows fairly commonly, and they also drop hard clues. Uh, one in one two eight, which isn't great. Um, I think with the combat achievement, it's saying one in one two one. So I guess you know, still around the one in one twenties. But it gives us the chance of getting another clue, but we also get the rune arrows on top of it. So that's the plan. Hopefully we'll get enough rune arrows together. If not, I'm going to have to start working out what I'm going to do. Um, but yeah, that's the little plan that I've come up with here. What I would say is the good thing is they are going to die a lot quicker than the hellhounds do. So we will get more kills for our balls. We got our first rune arrow drop. Six of them, which is a bit unlucky because they dropped five to 14 is the... Uh, is the drop rate so a little bit annoying uh, and it's one in 23 chance of getting rune arrows so yeah we'll see what we can do with that wow we got a clue scroll hard incredible let's do that no stop firing cannonballs please please stop firing cannonballs uh, drop that drop that no don't fire oh my god uh insane let's do that quickly so happy to see that imagine we can pull the msb now oh and also i'm sat on 53 rune arrows i would have expected a little bit more uh, I've killed 151 Ankus, but yeah. It, it, I think we started at, what, like 500 and something cannonballs? So if I can get 100 rune arrows together, I'll be more than happy. Ice Giants, drop anywhere between 5 to 14 adamant arrows for a 1 in 10 drop. Now, all we have are 88 cannonballs. It really isn't a lot. If, if I had like 250, I'd be feeling really confident right now. But you know what? We did get the bow. Um, I want to think we can at least pull like 30-ish arrows at, at the bare minimum, unless I go incredibly unlucky like I kind of have been. But they're very low level. They're 67. Uh, it is multi though, which is the scary part. You know what? Ah, don't. I can't attack yet. Stop it. Um, but, you know, we have to make sure we, you know, just attack as efficiently as possible with this blowpipe to make sure the blowpipe does as much damage as possible. So let's get that on. Let's do this. Uh, just start attacking. Fuck! They, they die- Oh my god, they die quick. They die fast. They die fast. We're going through them fast as well, though. Uh, you can kind of kill them so quick where they don't spawn incredibly fast. And it kind of helps negate on cannonballs a little bit. That's kind of the goal is just, again, to kill it as fast as possible. 11 kills in, and there is no- There's no arrows yet! Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. 13! 13! You know what? I should probably pick up that Addy Sword. I think that's my best weapon. I mean, I did get a Rune Dagger from the last clue, which actually gives plus one magic attack, doesn't it? 40... Four, I can't even fill it up all the way. Please get one more Addy drop. Please get one more Addy drop. I'm gonna fucking scream. Right there. Let's see it. Damn it. 
Oh my god, no. This is not happening. This is not happening. I've killed 28 so far. And I only have four cannonballs left. They're not, like, firing. I don't know why. Oh my god, stop. Stop. No. No. This will be my last kill. Come on. Come on. It's 1 in 10, dude. That's so bullshit. That is so fucking bullshit. Oh, I have drops fucking everywhere. Drops that I don't even need. All right, guys. Another casket. Another chance at that MSB. Come on. Oh, man. Man, man, man. That's so painful. Why am I getting so many black dehyde bodies? Ah, oh, okay. All right. Yeah, it's still it's still not a case of, like, we can go melee. Like, they're just not good enough. That's a shame. All right, back to Ankus and get as many rune arrows as possible. And maybe another hard clue. All right, coming into the last hundred cannonballs here. And I have 90 rune arrows. So, it's not ideal. But it's doable, I think. Hopefully, we can get another couple of drops in the last hundred here. Um, that would really help, obviously. Um, but, yeah... Unfortunately, the plan just hasn't come to fruition at all. I've just been getting duplicate black dehyde bodies, and that's it. Um, which meant we had to keep going for more and more clues. Hopefully, he goes magic, and we just, we're just able to blow him away like that. Um, we will see. We will see. We do get 12 more, so we've got over 100. Pretty happy with that. I will take that. 102 arrows. That should be okay. Should be okay. And that is it. Are we going to get the kill here? We are. Boom. What do we get? Nothing. Okay. That is everything, Bs and Gs. So let me tell you out of here and I'll show you the setup. We'll see what happened. We didn't get any more rude arrows after the last 12. So, oh dear. All right, guys. This is the setup. And we got a new little animation on our magic short bow eye because they just updated this actually. And believe it or not, we actually did get the scroll, which is fucking crazy. Um, but I don't think it's gonna make too much of a difference because we only have 13 arrows to bring to the fight Now of course 13 arrows isn't gonna last too long and it's not gonna really Have any sort of deep impact in the fight, but it is by far the best DPS I could get The question is is what I was gonna bring for a secondary Attack style and melee was the other obvious one because I did get the rune dagger the rune skirt the rune kite the problem with that is isn't so much the armor, it's the fact that I only had a rune dagger, which could get outclassed so easily with both magic, range, and melee. And I figured, I'm gonna pull a Hail Mary, just go the Ice Axe. I know Link's definitely gonna know Ice Axe are a thing. He knows I love the Wildy. He probably thinks I'm gonna go magic because, you know, I, I always bring these fucking Ice Axe and shit, but... I really don't see myself winning if I bring the full rune with the dagger. So, yeah, that's our backup plan. We have the one restore, bringing three tick eats, the rest anglerfish, and I will see you guys in the fight. All right, guys, this is the setup. I really don't know how this is going to go at all, to be honest. Uh, we will see how the magic longbow does. 102 rune arrows hopefully should be enough. Uh, especially as we're uh, a five tick with the with the longbow, so it's not going to be like firing out arrows at a super quick rate. Um, we got the black dehyde body, the rune plate legs, lovely magic defense. Other than that, not great. Uh, super store, so we can keep rigor on for the whole fight. Anglerfish for the whole thing. I am taking one blighted cramp one just in case he has like venge or something. And I need to get myself out of a tight spot. Um, and obviously, we're bringing the vengeance sacks as well, so we will be casting vengeance with this. Let's see how it goes. Kiddos. Yo. Bit of a weird one, that, wasn't it? I hated this. <laughs> I, like, we've done this before, this idea, but yeah. I went a very different approach. Okay. And right. I thought I had a really good fucking idea as well, and it kind of just, like, wasn't working. Okay. All right. Well, yeah. I'm looking forward to hearing that idea after the gear reveal, <laughs> because I, I had a similar sort of approach. I was like, okay, there's a, there's a few rules in this that change things up a bit. I'll go for mm -hmm. something. And again, it didn't really work out for me, mate. I'm not going to lie. Okay. That does make me feel <sighs> good. Okay. All right, man. Nah, not really. Just wait till you watch my footage, bro. <laughs> <laughs> wait till you watch my footage. Um, hit me with an item, dude, and we'll, uh, we'll go ahead and do this. Let's go body. Okay. All right. All right. Big, big item. Big item. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, legs. Oh, I don't really want 
to see. Uh, okay, we're mirroring each other, mate. Link, all I have is a weapon. That's all I have as well. <laughs> Fucking shit. Uh, I got, I got like three black beehive bodies, dude. I could not really. Yeah. Dude, I'm just gonna tell you right now, man. I didn't get my, cause I went to uh, Hellhounds. In the world, you and, slayer. Okay, yeah. So did I, mate. Yeah. So did I. <laughs> Fuck's sake. And I got my, I don't even remember. I said it in the video. I got my first clue at like 200 and like 19 in. Wow. Okay. I think mine was like Bad. 130 or something. So you killed um, me. Yeah. Well, I, I kill you. What do you mean I killed you? No, I got no, mine no, killed fucking... me with, with bad RNG, I mean. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's a weird way to word it. Okay, but, but yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And then, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll tell you right now, I did two clue scrolls. Wow, okay. I ended up doing four. That's what I estimated my minimum would be. Right, I did okay. This I mean, <laughs> uh, I wasn't happy with four, but I'm, ha I'm happy to hear you did less. All right, Kins, give us a three, two, one, man. Let's see what weapon he's got. All right, man. Three, two, one, <laughs> go. No! You managed to win. Oh, I got an abuse scroll as well, Kins. <laughs> no! Dude. Oh, I'm oh. so sad. Like, <laughs> uh, I don't think you should be that sad, though. I, I really don't. I really don't. Really? I, I had 88 cannonballs to get arrows. No. 88. No, 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 no. Oh, 88. You must have fuck all. What, what did you even go for? Ice, ice giants. And what? They don't, they don't drop higher than Addy, do they? No, they, they, yeah, no, you got it. You got it. They drop Addy. Good job, Addy. How many Addy arrows have you got? <laughs> I'm a little nervous to say. <laughs> yeah, please, just, please be less than 20. I'll just trade you the event. Less than 20. I'll just, I'll just trade okay, you the okay. uh, I'll tell you I went for arrows as well. Obviously, I had 400-ish cannonballs to get arrows. Right. Uh, oh. Yeah, it must be nice having 400 cannonballs for arrows. <laughs> it must be nice. <laughs> So yes, Link, I do have a backup plan because uh, obviously 13 isn't going to last me in the fight. Yeah. Actually, uh, let's just, uh, let's just get a inventory. You'll fucking see my backup plan. Oh. 13. Oh no. All right, man. Let's get a little cheeky trade off. Um, obviously I've already seen what arrows, the arrows, but you said yeah. you had some So backup. I'm, I'm bringing one of these. Me too. Me too. Bringing some combo eats. I'm bringing one. Okay. All right. Uh, now Link, I had I had two options. Mm -hmm. I had two options, and I'm a little annoyed now. I mean, obviously, I know you're going range now, so in hindsight, it's just like so fucking dumb to yeah. be doing this. But obviously, I didn't know. Yeah. You were yeah, gonna have yeah, a fucking yeah, yeah. Black D hide body, which and you like... see where this is going. Yeah. But I did also get a a rune, uh, skirt, rune kite, and a rune dagger. Wow. And I decided. To just say fuck it, YOLO. I'm gonna bring no extra gear to waste no extra slots and then just bring magic. And obviously I would have brought Venge then. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which I'm gonna assume is your last slot, right? You, there. you are correct. I got about three hundred, but I, I didn't Yeah, I got a fucking piss um, as well. Oh my thought process was you are definitely going magic as your main, and that's why I went range. And then obviously I was like, if he's going magic, there's no point in me bringing ice barrages. So that's why I went with the Avengers. Oh, it's funny because magic was like my just backup, backup. Wow, plan. I really thought you'd be like, get, get the get the ice sacks and then just get a full mage. Oh, like, dude, I I the moment you told me clue scrolls were allowed in this challenge, I was like, right, okay, <laughs> this guy literally like planned it around this. Uh, I actually it. watched our last video that we did this on oh, and really? fuck me it was very different yeah. like without clue scrolls it was just bad we yeah. both had very awful setups so I was like clue scrolls is the way okay so. all right let's see what uh, happens to this one dude let's see get okay, nice my G Yo. I will uh, I won't prevenge I'll wait till the uh, the timer starts or the fight starts I guess and then we'll all right are you ready oh, I am ready mate I am ready all right, school prevention is off. Prayer on, two second warning now. Okay. We're just gonna, we're just gonna dump specs, guys. 
And uh, I mean, the, the obvious play for me is, guys, I just waste all my arrows and then switch to Barrage. There's no overheads or anything. He doesn't have any gear switches. So... What I would say for you, the Venge probably isn't going to be too fucking deadly because your hits aren't going to be, like, huge, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Let's eat, let's eat, let's eat. It's just annoying that I don't have it now. Is yeah, really I mean, obviously, about it's, it's, it's like when someone has a recoil and the other person doesn't, it's just annoying losing out on the damage. But, ooh. Yeah. Guaranteed hit. Oh. Ooh. Better make sure I'm picking these up. Because he is going to carry on after those 13 arrows are up. I, I will be here. <laughs> <laughs> I just going to give up. He's just like, okay, I'm done. Okay. I mean, I, I'd say, to be honest, guys, the magic longbow is fine. It's not You're horrendous. You're not doing too bad. Yeah, it's not horrendous at all. What surprises me is it's the exact same magic uh, of range attack bonus as the MSB. Yeah, but you get that extra extra square, like, oh, you know? Oh, huge. Yeah, I can't you wait to that use that in You get that extra square. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Come on, God. Is that it? Is that okay, it for the Taste Venge? Taste Vengeance. I am low, fellas. I am fucking yeah, low. Sorry, I'm moving all over yeah. the place. I don't really have a, I don't have a choice. Oh, <laughs> oh no, he's the moving max, on. The max. Big, big, big. 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 Come on, hit. Now, hit me now. The one Venge, you hate to see it. Okay, now it's power play time. It's power play time, guys. It's power play time. There's no way. No! What? Oh my god, we just hit. Okay. What? I, that, let's hope that wasn't an anomaly. How on earth did you hit there? That's, that's actually a joke. We're still good on arrows. We're still so good on arrows. Fuck, I could have spent more time doing something else, guys. I didn't realize 100 was going to be way too much. Oh, he catches it. Oh, you can't overeat anymore, can you? For fuck's sake. They changed how the uh, the Fuck. anglerfish work, guys. Yeah, they did. And you can't overeat on them anymore in the wildy after being attacked after like 10 seconds or some shit. Nice. Oh. Back to back 23s. Yeah, it's that's insane, trading bro. it, bro. <laughs> it's insane. Oh, this is lovely. This is lovely. Bang. Dead. Yeah, that's the tricky oh. part. Yeah, you're in so much trouble because catching a freeze is so hard. Oh my god. Mm. Come on, come on, come on, you beauty. Come on. The Venge coming back out. Oh, he's hugging the trees! <laughs> he's hugging the trees! Come on, he can't he can't be hitting. He can't be hitting. I want my arrows, man. Fuck it. Give up. I like it. There we go. He's back in. He's back in. Back in the game. Uh, should Come on. Be, should, should have this from here, guys. This I'd be very surprised if he pulls anything off here. Come on. Catch a freeze. Oh, an eight. Catch a freeze. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead, surely. Fuck. Catch a fucking freeze. How the fuck are you still going, man? I feel like I've just been hitting you constantly. 15 venge. Yes, please. <laughs> he's all over the place. There we go. Put him down. Put him out of his misery. Put him out of his misery. Put him out of his misery, bro. Don't do it, Link. Come on, come on, come on, bang. Dead, 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 dead. Lovely. Come on. Oh, man, you got shafted on the arrows. I feel for you. I feel for you. No, I got shafted on, on, on clues. Yeah. 
I got shafted on clues. I actually thought 13 arrows with 88 cannonballs wasn't bad. <laughs> yeah, it was. I, did, I didn't think I was going to get any. <laughs> it was a good effort, mate. Good effort. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Peace and Jays. Thank you very much for watching. We will catch you in the next one. Don't forget to check out all the videos that uh, come out after this. And uh, stay subscribed so you can uh, see all of them when they come out. And uh, go subscribe over to Kins as well for the same reasons. We will catch you in the next one. Bye.